A group of nine American Muslims, most of them headed to Florida with their family members for vacation, were removed from an air train flight at Reagan National Airport. It happened after other passengers complained about a comment overheard after boarding. In that conversation, we started talking a little bit about, you know, just airplane safety and where the safest place to sit is on a plane in case some accident or mm -hmm. in case something happens. And I guess from that conversation, someone had maybe gleamed that maybe we were planning on doing something to the plane. According to a statement from AirTran, the captain of the flight informed the airline that there were two federal air marshals on board who contacted law enforcement officials for a security-related issue that involved comments made by a passenger and overheard by other passengers. The statement says everyone was ordered off the plane. The Council on American Islamic Relations says the Muslim passengers were detained, questioned and cleared by the FBI, but not allowed back on the flight. I mean, it's not like we used any kind of words like, you know, terror or bomb or anything like that, but simply, you know, people want to hear what they want to hear sometimes. And the travelers say they were assisted by the FBI in arranging flights on another airline hours later. Some of them feel they were the victims of profiling. Uh, we weren't even questioned, my wife and I, uh, nor were our kids, but the passengers that we were with were questioned, and I guess by association they deemed us unfit to fly the airline at this time as well. They said it was a security concern. And even after the FBI agent and the special agent went to them and explained to them that there's absolutely nothing wrong, like we're cleared, you know, completely safe. They, you know, wouldn't issue us any sort of apology. 